Delivery to one's doorstep has become a given in so many consumer aspects nowadays. And now a local food pantry is taking its pandemic produced grocery delivery service and bringing it to the next level with a partnership with Instacart. We found out why the organization says this new move is all about getting back to its empowerment roots. Loading up love and an antidote to hunger. Loaves and Fishes volunteer Vicki Shulsted has been delivering groceries for about two years and knows the impact these packages of food make to those in need. These people, a lot of them can't leave home. A lot of them are elderly and sick. These people that have children, you see the children will come out sometimes to help take the boxes in. Home delivery is a relatively new feature for the food pantry, which has always prided itself on letting customers shop their own orders with dignity. But in April 2020, it pivoted to contactless drop off amid COVID concerns, removing some elements of self shopping from the experience. Sometimes we take for granted just the ability to go to the grocery store and choose your favorite cereal or your favorite produce. Loaves and Fishes COO Danielle Moore says that's where a new partnership with Instacart innovated the process. The nationwide grocery delivery company lets Loaves use its technology to create its own online store where clients can pick and choose their food pantry orders exactly to their liking. They absolutely love it, especially clients that have a lot of dietary restrictions allergies, or maybe even chronic health conditions. For now, Instacart is offering this service for free, and volunteers will continue to drive the orders. But where it goes from here is still simmering. Moore says by the numbers, this seems to be the way of the future. Loaves going from 8,000 delivery clients in 2020 to 16,000 last year, and an anticipated 20,000 by the end of this year. We knew long before the pandemic, that many of our clients struggle with transportation. And so it's not just about the food, but it's about the food and the last mile of getting it right to their doorstep. A task Scholsted says she is grateful to take on. Well, people should be able to eat. And so Loaves and Fishes says more than 1,300 people have used their Instacart based ordering system so far. As for what the overall need looks like, well, the organization says it's seeing a lot more than even during the early start of the pandemic last year. Amid inflation and high housing and gas costs, all of its assistance programs are seeing 90% more demand or even higher.